o'clock, the Kurt Vonnegut Museum will soon have a permanent home in Indianapolis. Museum officials confirmed they hit their $900,000 fundraising goal late last night. News 8's Angelie Cockaday is following this story for us this morning. Hi, Angelie. Good morning, Scott and Drew. That's right, the museum did meet its fundraising goal, but it was certainly a close call. Museum officials said as of Wednesday morning, they were $75,000 short. The goal was to raise $900,000. A couple foundations said if they met that goal, they would help pitch in the rest of the $600,000. Museum officials said they needed $1.5 million to buy and maintain a new space at 543 Indiana Avenue. The museum honors the Indiana-born author of Slaughterhouse Five. Its current location is a donated space and they're being asked to leave. Now, with the fundraising goal met, the museum will have a new permanent home. The new location will make the museum more accessible to visitors and allow for more space for a new Slaughterhouse Five exhibit. Museum officials said they plan to partner with downtown's Bluebeard restaurant to open a cafe inside. The Kurt Vonnegut Museum and Library is an iconic institution for the city of Indianapolis. It's not just for those of us who live in Indianapolis. Um, it's also for all the folks who come visit Indianapolis. It's, it's a cultural touchstone for the city. In a Facebook post, the museum thanked all the people who donated, saying they are past the first important step to being able to open Kurt's forever home for you. Even as Wednesday night's deadline approached, museum officials were confident they'd reach their goal. They told News 8 as long as human beings engage in the folly of war, Slaughterhouse 5 will be relevant. Scott and Drew, back to you. Angelie, thank you.